National Committee on its last hearings on Friday for the week um, had Sip OP George Alexander Mensah in attendance. In Friday's hearings, he did indicate and state categorically clearly that the IGP Dr. George Kufu Dampare is the character behind the taping and the leaking of the audio tape that is at the center of this entire controversy. My intel suggests that what was used to tape the conversation was done by the current IGP. He sent some people to do it, and after which he went for it. So the tape, from my intel, is with the IGP, and he caused it to be leaked. So if this committee wants the tape, the right person to call before this committee is the Inspector General of Police. At a point in time in Friday's hearings, he did indicate through himself and through his lawyers that he needed a break to do a comparative analysis between the transcript of the audio tape and the audio tape itself for the purposes of indicating where his voice, his voice was tampered with, where the tape was doctored, and where he could indicate clearly that this was his voice. And we also noted that the portion of the audio was not so clear at all. We couldn't hear anything at all. So it will be very, very difficult for the witness to remember which portion, maybe the 20th minutes in the audio which have been transcribed here, which is not clear. So if the witness had the, 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 the audio that the committee is investigating, together with the transcript, he could come back and say, OK, when I listen to the uh, audio which you were, you, were, you were investigating, and the transcript which you claim to have made of it, I do not think this was on the audio, or even if it is in the transcript, I did not say so. He could say so because of um, um, having listened to the audio. COP George Alex Mensa they tell the committee once again that it was Bugri Nabu who reached out to him through Superintendent Asari as a likely candidate to replace the IGP because the MPP and the president were considering changing Dampari from the removing him from his position as IGP uh, for that matter. The chairman of the committee at the end of Friday's hearings told the press that the committee is considering inviting the IGP to answer some of the concerns that have been raised about his leadership and some of the concerns raised at the committee generally. For the IGP to be hauled before the committee or to be invited in relating to the matters in issue, is this a, is this a, a request that the committee would consider? It's a likelihood, you see, and it's all gotten to do with how the evidence is evolving. So it's a likelihood because the facts we should place before parliament, the plenary, should not be shoddy. It should not be one-sided. So it's a likelihood. Duke Mento Popo, TV3 News, Accra, Parliament House.